turn. Flailing end per turn. And I will pass it over to you. Okay. Draw for turn. God damn it. Play a land for turn. And pass it to you. Draw for turn. Land for turn. And I will tap two to bring out my walking corpse. And I will pass it over to you. He is a 2 2. Draw for turn. <clears throat> I will tap my planes and cast my Ranger's Hawk. A 1 1 with flying. And pass it to you. Two play walking corpse. Eighty-two. And I will swing at you for two. And I will go down to eighteen. Might as well get him in while I can. And I'll pass it over to you. On tap. Draw for turn. I knew I shouldn't have kept this fucking hand, dude. I'll pass it to you. So let me okay. I'll untap. Draw for turn. I play land for turn. Then I will tap three and play Lost Legion. When he enters the battlefield, I can scry two. And you know what? I am going to keep both cards at the top of the deck. I will change their order, but I will keep both cards at the top. <clears throat> and I will swing at you for two. <laughs> I will go down to 16. Draw for turn. Jesus fucking Christ, bro. Tap my planes. Cast a ranger's hawk. And swing at you for one flying. Take one. Put you down to 19. Um, and then I pass my turn. I've got eight cards, so I've got to discard one. And I will get rid of my Celestius Sanctifer and put them in the graveyard. I, uh, will untap everything. Draw for turn. Play land for turn. And I will play. Oh, I will tap three. play demonic embrace it's an enchantment gives my enchanted creature plus three plus one so he is now up to a five four on to my lost legion and it also gives him flying i will tap one to play my serrated scorpion who is a 1-2, and I will pass it on over to you after that. Wow. 
I will untap, draw for turn, cast a planes for turn, and I will pass. I will draw for turn. I will play your untap everything. And I will play. I'll go ahead and swing at you for ten with everything. Five of that's for flying with flying. Okay. I will tap both my planes and cast. You hear something on watch. This spell deals five damage to target attacking creature. I will choose your lost legion. And then... And the enchantment goes away as well, right? Yes. So now what am I looking at? Five? Five. I'll, I'll take the five and go down to 11. Okay. Uh, after that, I'll pass it over to you. I will untap, draw for turn. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. I will swing at you for one flying. I'll take one. Okay, that puts you down to 18. And I'm going to be smart this time and actually take the initiative like I should have done last time. And I'll pass it to you. Okay. I will untap. <sighs> I'll draw for turn. I'll then tap six. And sacrifice walking corpse. To bring out Gorman, who is a five five with you... flying and trample. Do you have to sacrifice someone to bring him out? Is that why you did that? Yes. As an additional spe uh, cost to cast this spell, sacrifice a creature. Oh, I'm sorry. I did not read this. When Gormand enters the battlefield, each opponent sacrifices a creature. So I actually have to sacrifice another creature. And you have to sacrifice a creature as well. Okay. <clears throat> And I will um, swing at you for one. And I will block him with my ranger's hawk. Okay. That's on over to you. Or Wait. since my yeah, he's a since one. My three, three scorpions a one two. He lives one right? two. Correct. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, I'll pass it over to you. Okay, since you didn't deal combat damage to me, I keep the initiative. Mm -hmm. Whenever you take the initiative at the beginning of your upkeep, venture into the Undercity, which is a dungeon. Mm -hmm. At the secret entrance, search your library for a basic land card, reveal it, put it into your hand, and then shuffle. It is literally on the bottom of my deck. Do I need to shuffle? Nope. Brilliant. Okay, then I will draw for turn. Yep. I'll play my land for turn. I'm going to tap all three and cast my Priest of Ancient Lore. He's a 2 1. Whenever Priest of Ancient Lore enters the battlefield, you gain one life and draw a card. I will go up to 12 and draw a card. And then I will pass it to you. Okay. I will untap everything. Draw for turn. Play land for turn. 
And I will swing at you for seven. Or six, I'm sorry, six. I can't block anything, so I will take six and go down to six. Okay. Yeah, then I'll then I'll pass it over to you. Untap. And draw for turn. I'll play land for turn. Consolidate these a little bit. You're tapped out, so I'm going to swing at you for two. Take two. Just going to put you down to 16. Um, did I fuck up? I think I just fucked up. I just lost the game. So, now that I am to my second main phase after combat, I'm going to tap all four of my planes and cast Day of Judgment, destroy all creatures. I'm going to play... Or I'm going to tap two and play uh, Unlikely Aid on Gormand. Our creature gets plus two, plus you... zero, and gains indestructible until end of turn. It's an instant. Sweet. Obviously, I equip it to Gormand. Sorry, it's Scorpion. It's destroyed. And that's all I can do. Draw feeling for turn. You have seven? Six. Okay. Um, I'll swing at you for five. Hold on one second. So I will go down to one. And I will pass it over to you. On tap. Draw for turn. I'll play a land for turn. I will tap two and cat. Oh, it doesn't fucking matter. I just realized that. But yeah, whatever. I cast Steadfast Paladin and I'll tap my remaining three and cast a Moon Blessed Cleric and pass it over to you. Then I'll untap. And then I'll get you for five. 